hey guys welcome back so on today's journey i will be sharing with you some meals i prepared throughout this month being meat free i did incorporate some seafood even though by definition seafood is classified as meat however for dietary and culinary purposes the distinction is often made between the two so let's jump right into it I incorporated a variety of nuts and fruits so I had lots of fruit plates and smoothies and the fruits I went for were lots and lots of berries, watermelon, oranges, bananas, avocados, star fruits. Now if you're on a tight budget these are fruits that will fit right in. Next up, we have some oven-baked plantain chips, which is perfect for snack time. The beauty about this, you can season to your liking and make it even more appealing to your taste buds. Mmm, so let's dive into this guacamole. Now, I have a video showcasing the preparation process. I will leave the link in the description below. Now, this pairs well with tortilla chips or even the famous Jamaican water crackers. So on the heavier side of things, I have my pasta dish, which includes peas and beans to add to my protein content. It also includes carrots and corn, and this is all bounded together in coconut milk. All right, this dish is also quite filling. It has butter bean with salt fish, also called salted cod, and it has yellow yam, sweet potatoes, green plantains, and cassava, which is also called yuca. So let's take this down a notch and enjoy this assorted seafood salad, which has a base of cabbage, raw cabbage, and carrots. Final dish for today is my shrimp fried rice. Now this has absolutely no eggs included. I'm not sure if that changes the name of the dish, but hey, it tasted just as good. Thank you guys for coming along on today's journey. Be sure to join me on the next trail. Walk good.